now have the address and official opening of Farm Fest 2010 by His Excellency, the Most Honorable Sir Patrick Allen, Governor General of Jamaica. Dr. Mark Panton, representing the Minister of Agriculture and Fisheries, Mr. Roger Clark, Opposition Spokesman for Agriculture and Fisheries, Mr. Noel Arscott, Member of Parliament for South Southwest Clarendon, Mr. Houghton Fraser, Chairman of, and of the Managing and Management Auditing Committee of the Ebony Park Academy, members of the Board of Directors of the Heart Trust NTA, Dr. Carvin A, Executive Director and other members of the staff of Heart Trust NTA, Reverend Joseph Rose, distinguished guests, sponsors of Farm Fest, principals and teachers, students, members of the media. Good morning. Good morning. And I want to extend a warm greeting to each one of you as we assemble for the opening of Farm Fest 2010 and the Agro Eco Tourism Program, creating pathways for sustainable development. Firstly, I want to take this opportunity to thank our youngsters who just performed so admirably and energetically. <laughs> I wondered, as I watched them, what would life be like without our young people? Uh, they, are, they give us life and energy and even those, of, even those of us who are, like myself, uh, looking at the sunset of our lives, we are energized in the company of young people, wherever they serve, whether in the schools, whether they serve with, them, with us on boards and organizations, they bring life to our existence and vibrancy and the promise of the, for the future and the promise of a great Jamaica. So I want to thank our young people and I want to thank all of you who have come out from the various schools and institutions to join the family here at Ebony Park in this, for this function. I recognize that there are teachers and students from other institutions here in Clarendon and probably elsewhere. I see some from Edwin Allen comprehensive from Carver Castillo and I'm sure other institutions along with of course our host Emily Park and other institutions are represented whose uniforms I cannot identify at this time but we are so pleased to see you and it's nice of you young people to come out and participate in this AgroFest uh, ceremony. I was given a script to read to you, but I figure that your people don't like to listen to long and boring speeches. <laughs> and I, I think the three speakers so far have ably uh, capsulated what needs to be said about in a broad brush of scope of agriculture, what it represents and what it means to us here in Jamaica and uh, the importance of agriculture. Suffice it to say that I want to single out Ebony Park and to commend them for the outstanding work that they are doing. I want to let you know also that there are members of the Governor General's staff who were trained here at Ebony Park. have some butlers and some folk who work 
in the landscaping areas and farming who are right here and are proud to identify with Eva Decor. So keep up the good work, Eva Decor. I suspect that today we will get an opportunity to learn more about what our young people are doing in agriculture and why it is so important for our young people to be involved in agriculture. You know the theme in the Ministry of Agriculture. What is it? Eat what you grow. Eat what you grow and grow what you eat. That seems to be on the lips of everybody in Jamaica. And the times demand that we eat what we grow and grow what we want to eat. That means that we're going to be looking within ourselves and we are going to be tailoring our taste buds to a certain degree to eat what we have around us. And what we have, I must say, are very nutritious food, good for the body, and, uh, and they are natural. The more natural the substance that you put in your body, the better it is for you. Uh, and, the, and the more they are naturally processed, I should say, and the quicker they get to the table, it is better for you as you consume and eat and desire to be healthy. We can grow all that we want to do. Do you believe that? Yes. Yes, we can do that. I, I don't want to use the term, uh, yes we can, <laughs> but we're using instead the term, I believe. Have you ever heard that expression?